Uh, my experience in IH Delft has been very good. Uh, I've learned a lot about um, what I wanted to learn about uh, dealing with wastewater. All the things that are related with it, you know, not only like the technical part. Um, but I think it was very good because it uh, allows me to go deep in this kind of technical knowledge but also allowed me to meet people from all over the world, to have different experience, to grow in other aspects in life that in other parts you cannot find. I will definitely recommend somebody else to study here at IRC Delft, not only because of uh, the knowledge, scientific knowledge that you get here, but also about the knowledge you get from the experiences you have with other cultures and other people. Uh, I did my research in Zambia for my thesis and uh, I was uh, trying to understand the gender norms. So how do men, women, children and different sections of the society perceive water issues differently? So it was more about me living in a very small remote village in Zambia and trying to understand the issues. And it was so very real, like in that study I realized something like it's not just the experts who are who, who know, who can diagnose a water issue, but also the people who are going undergoing a problem, they are also the one who have equal say and weightage in what exactly the issue is. My research is at a nexus of social sciences and technical science. So it's, it goes more into water provisioning, but water access. So how do men, women, children have access to water differently? And this looking at water problem through gender lens is very relevant and actually very urgent in our societies because it's not just the experts who can diagnose a water problem, but also the, the real people who are more connected to the issue and their voices and what do they think and what do they feel is the real problem. So it's not just relevant, but it's very urgent. I studied like environmental science with specialization in environmental planning, implementation and planning. And in environmental planning and management, here uh, I study identifying our problems, then making our plans and executing our plans, and which is very relevant to hydropower. And also while doing my uh, thesis, as of now, I have learned a lot in QGIS, modeling tools, and uh, R statistics, like doing statistics with R. And that will be very relevant to my future career, like if I want to focus on PhD, so that will be very much helpful. So it has been very relevant to me. I have learned uh, lots of lessons in IG here, like being a humble is a great. For example, just citing example, Rector here. Actually, he's a very learned man. He have a lot of knowledge and he deserves our respect. But then I can see him like just coming to a coffee machine to get his own coffee. And if a line is very long and he waits in a queue just to get his coffee. And that is very uh, great, like very humble. So I feel like being humble is great. So that is the lesson that I'm going to take, being very humble. The overall experience at IIT Delft has been pretty overwhelming, I believe. Um, I've got to meet a lot of people from across the globe and it's really uh, great to uh, interact with different people and different professors from different backgrounds uh, where, they, uh, where we can share knowledge uh, across our fields and across our backgrounds. So I think it's, it has really offered me an edge to uh, be a part of this uh, global community and speak about water and the issues in our countries back home so that we can implement what we learn here. I really got to see how things work in real life, how the organizations and stakeholders deal with each other and across uh, other communities and across the common man. So it was really um, a challenging experience to assess how they bring their knowledge across the other platforms and how uh, they have to manage the, po the political situation of water. So assessing that and an analyzing that in a very critical manner was um, a really helpful part for me during the course of the fieldwork. This study will assist me to participate actively in the research programs and to affect the student learning positively. And it has also equipped me with the knowledge that is required of me in order to be able to be, not to be suitable for academic and environment and my ambition is to become a, one of the leading a faculty member in a leading university in Nigeria and in Africa. All, all institutions that deal with water, IHE, IHE Delft is the best. The knowledge in class and the knowledge in the field trip cannot be acquired in any other institution so far.
you want to become a, if you want to become a water professional, IHE is the best. Before coming here to IIT, I had been working as an assistant lecturer back in Nepal. The master's degree that I pursued here has enriched my knowledge about the water science and specifically hydrology. I hope I can transfer this knowledge to a greater mass back, back in Nepal through teaching. So I did my research in Mozambique, that's in southern Africa. The research was about the small reservoir systems, which are environmentally friendly for nature. Uh, and I got this opportunity to see the African lifestyle, culture, taste food. It was really a nice experience for me. As part of my master thesis, uh, I went to do field work in Palestine, in the West Bank. And there I had to contact many uh, people that worked with the wastewater operation and management. And uh, the project is about decentralized treatment of wastewater and reclaimed water usage. So it was very interesting to see their perception about it. And also, it, I, I call it like a crash course of diplomacy because I had to uh, learn how to interact with such a different culture and understand their conflict and uh, know how I, how I can uh, interact with them in the best way in order to get the information I needed. And it was also a very positive personal experience in my life. I, would say. I think the, the most important lesson that I get from, from my HE is that people are people everywhere. So if you uh, are from another culture, from another religion or from another country and you have uh, less or more experience than our, your colleague, if you have common interests to solve an issue or to work together, it will be possible to do if you uh, have these common interests. So that's what I learned and I, I really had to work a lot with people and I really loved that here. Yeah, it was a, my field trip was very good uh, because I had opportunity to travel with a group of professionals. Actually, my classmates were not uh, ordinary students, they were all professionals from different countries. And we went to uh, Spain, uh, Portugal, uh, and I had opportunity to visit the vegetable garden and the impact of that uh, uh, horticulture boom on uh, environment, especially over abstraction of ground water. So I saw uh, I saw the problems and how the how the experts are dealing with the problem and want to address the problem. Yeah, what I'm studying currently is water management and governance. It's uh, it's very related to my uh, job uh, because uh, in my in Afghanistan we have four major uh, uh, river basin which is uh, which are uh, shared with uh, with other countries so i've studied here water and environmental law uh, which is very helpful for me to uh, to address the problem of sharing water between us and other countries